ZNS Total Sports, brought to you by Fourth Terrace Diagnostic Center. Welcome to sports, everybody. Following Junior Junkanoo last weekend, officials at the National Sports Authority now gearing up for the inaugural IAAF World Relays next May. And according to General Manager Jeffrey Beckles, it starts with the resurfacing of the track. Mondo and their team have uh, begun this process yesterday afternoon, and we're very pleased that we've actually gotten started. And uh, our objective now is to be able to be able to deliver the track on time for an April finish, so that we can be ready for our test events uh, before the big relays come in May. Now, Sports Minister Dr. Daniel Johnson explains why work has to be done to the track ahead of the World Relays. We made some errors in our last installation of this track in that you should have the inspectors, the IAAF and the engineers on site on each occasion during the process. So when you're done, um, everyone knows it is done and it's done properly. And so we'll have those three parties working together with our team, Ministry of Works, NSA, International Inspectors, IAAF and Mondo on scene at all times. This marks our initial move on the world stage in terms of hosting world-class events that are capable of handling any level of play. So this is IAAF Class 1 certification, a first-class uh, track that, that could host any kind of world event. Well, former world and Olympic champion in the men's 400 meters, Jeremy Warner, is in town on vacation, and he's taking advantage of the warm weather to do some off-season training, which he hopes will get him ready for the 2014 season and a possible spot on Team USA for the World Relays. It's not up to me if I'm going to be running or not. It's up to a USA track and field, and, you know, if I get chosen, I'll be here, and I'll give it all I got, and, you know. Uh, the Bahamian people here have been all, always been uh, real respectful and, and love the sport of track and field. And uh, I'm just looking forward to coming out here and actually getting to run in the new stadium. I ran in the old stadium back in 02 for uh, juniors, and uh, you now I'm looking forward to getting into the bigger one now. Now in the man's 4x4 relay, Warner knows the Bahamas is always a threat to the USA, and he had no problem showing respect where it was due as he thought back to the win by our Golden Knights at the London Olympics. You know they ran smart. They uh, they knew who 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 was what on on our relay. They knew uh, who they would match up well with, and and but at the same time they didn't worry about that. They just ran their same race that they ran in the prelims, and you know they they fought hard, and we haven't seen that out of a lot of teams lately. And you know for them to go out there and compete the way they did, it's great to see. And that will do it for sports. But don't go anywhere. There's more to come after the break. This is ZNS Total Sports, brought to you by 4th Terrace Diagnostic Center.